Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is September 3rd. Yeah, it's Friday. And I'm gonna hop on here and show with you, show, share with you <laughs> my new moving stitch square that I have completed. So this is moving stitch square in. I'm really behind, but that's okay. I'm catching up slowly but surely. I'll get there. <laughs> um, so my movie for in was Nanny McPhee, the first one, which I love those movies. I completely forgot about them when I was talking about in movies recently. And I forgot how good they are. I love them a lot. They're really good. They're right up there with Mary Poppins. Kind of similar to Mary Poppins. But Mary Poppins is better, in my opinion. But I think it's just because that's the classic to me. So I grew up watching Mary Poppins. And then I watched Nanny McPhee when it came out. So, <laughs> anyways. I made my square. Now, my square is based off of the colors of the interior of the house. I love the house on Nanny McPhee. Because it's like painted crazy colors. And all the furniture is like crazy and um, eclectic and colorful <laughs> and then I also made a beehive <laughs> because of the wedding scene towards the end of the movie um, when the kids are trying to figure out how to get uh, the wedding between their dad and that horrible woman um, you know over with uh, they pretend to have bees and then there really are bees and all that and they're saying beehive instead of behave and uh, yeah so that's what this is based off of <laughs> so here's my square <laughs> So the pink and the blue is from the interior of the house where the stair uh, cases. There's also a purple color, but I don't have any purple scrap balls. So I just used pink and blue. <laughs> and uh, my purple yarn is in the bedroom and Devin's sleeping right now. He works uh, nights, so I didn't wanna go in there and bug him to get purple. So I just used this. And boy, I played yarn chicken with this pink. I just barely had enough yarn to finish my slip stitch and pull it through to be able to knot it right here because I'm going to back this blanket so I don't care if there's knots but that little tail was all I had left of pink so I used up all that ball but this is red heart um I think it's called hot pink or bright pink and then this is uh Takura and then my little beehive I looked for an applique pattern and I couldn't find one that was free so I just kind of looked at one and my, that's my washer back there <laughs> uh, I'm always doing laundry but um I saw one on Etsy, like it pulled up on Google Images, and um, I'll link that below if I can think about it. I didn't want to buy the whole pattern set just to get the beehive, so I just kind of copied it. <laughs> so um, I made these four little yellow oval things, <laughs> you know, you make a chain and you work on both sides of it, and stacked them up there and sewed them, and then I made this little black bee door. <laughs> um, which is black yarn and it was, I just uh, chained like five, I think, and then I did a single crochet, a half double crochet, and then two doubles back in it. And it made like a door. <laughs> I think it turned out pretty cute. I'm using the lamp today. I don't have the window open, so it might be weird. This yellow is Red Heart Super Saver too. It's not bright yellow though. It's the one that's, um, it's not cornmeal. I think it has something to do with daffodils or something like that. Uh, it's, it's, not bright yellow but it's the one that's like right under bright yellow <laughs> so that's my square and it's the same square pattern as one i've been using it's the simple says it best square by the perfect knot i've just been using the same square because it's easy and they come out the same size when i use the right yarns and uh yeah so i got my end movie done i see i got my stack right here can you see them yeah that's my moving stitch squares these are my christmas blanket squares which i have not worked on i need to do that <laughs> so i'm gonna stick him up there feel fit. I'm going to have to push him back and make another row. <laughs> but we're getting there because now that's that's in. So next is O. I already watched my O movie. I just have to make the square. I already know what it's going to be. The movie is free on Tubi. It's called... I thought I knew what it was called. <laughs> it's on my phone, but I'm recording on my phone. Uh, what is it called? It's either called One Simple Night. No, One Special Night. It's got Julie Andrews in it. And I can't remember the man's name that's in it, but he's the guy that plays as Woodrow Wilson in not uh, Lonesome Dove, because that's uh, Tommy Lee Jones, but in the sequels to Lonesome Dove, he is, uh, I'm not for sure he's in Streets of Laredo. I can't remember if he's in Return to Lonesome Dove. Anyways, it's the guy that plays as Woodrow. <laughs> I don't know what his name is. I think it's Jeff something. But uh, it's got Julie Andrews in it. Older Julie Andrews. Came out probably in the 90s. And it's a really good movie. I watched it just one day on Tubi. I was looking up Christmas movies. And it popped up. And it's a really sweet movie. Because uh, it's a love movie. But it's about older people who fall in love after their uh, husbands and wives pass away and stuff. And it's just it's just a really sweet movie. <laughs> so I watched that and I absolutely loved it. And I want to make a square after it. I already know what I want to make. I just have to do it. But that's going to be my old movie. 
and then I have no idea what the rest of them are. <laughs> I had one for P, but I can't remember now what it was. But I'm slowly working on them. I'm hoping to get caught up. Uh, definitely by the end of the year, I think I should be good. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to say that. But my, my washer just stopped, so i got to go put it in the dryer. And i got two baskets of laundry that's clean behind y'all that I have to hang up and fold and all that stuff. So I'm going to sit here and watch some TV and get all that laundry caught up. And soon it'll be time to get Jesse. I ran around doing errands today. My mom has COVID. She's okay. She's pretty sick with it, but she's not horribly sick. Um, she does have underlying conditions, so we're, we're worried, you know, but we're not. It's not to the point yet where it's um, like she doesn't have to go to the hospital. She's being treated for it, and uh, the only thing we can't find is zinc. Her doctor wanted her to buy some zinc to take along with some vitamins and stuff, and it's sold out everywhere. But uh, she's doing good, so I had to, I've been running errands <laughs> for her ever since she got sick. She's been sick about a week. A little over a week um you know taking them grocery things that they need and medications and stuff and today i had to run and pay some of her bills for her and what else did i do i went to kohl's for myself because i had kohl's cash every time i get kohl's cash i use it to get christmas presents for jesse <laughs> every year i do that because um it's basically like free money you know and i always use it to get toys through kohl's website because they usually have good deals on them so I went and picked up some of those Lego sets that I got hiding in the closet that I got to wrap and then put up. I like Christmas shopping early. <laughs> we Our goal is to always be done Christmas shopping by Halloween so that we don't have to um, stress about it through the holidays. And it's worked so far for us. It's really easy to Christmas shop now because everyone we, we shop for is teenagers and adults now except my nephew and Jesse and my nephew is to the point now he's 10 now where he wants like gift cards and game cards for um his xbox and all that so now everybody pretty much gets money gifts <laughs> except jesse until the baby's born but uh so we're just buying jesse little toys and things here and there stocking up <laughs> and um i always like having them already here so that if the weather's bad or you know if covid flares up really bad again or something we don't have to worry about going to buy Christmas gifts around Christmas. I mean, Devin, we don't really usually do gifts for each other or we'll just, we'll talk about what we want and then we'll just buy it and that'll be like the gift that we got each other. Um, yeah, so that's totally random. I'm just I always sidetrack, but that's just me. But yeah, so I'm exhausted because I was, took Jesse to school, came home and then my mom, I messaged my mom to see if she needed anything uh, because it's, she's, a, on, uh, she's disabled. <laughs> so she's on disability. So she got her check today and uh, I thought she might need me to, you know, do something for her since she can't go anywhere <laughs> and then I ended up having I went and got them breakfast at Hardee's and took it up to them and then I had to go to the town next to us that's bigger and do errands for her which is fine but I'm just exhausted <laughs> I did that for three hours running around I was gonna go shopping I, was, I thought about going to Hobby Lobby while I was in that town but I was just so tired by the time I got like Kohl's because I had to wait forever in line at Kohl's there's people returning stuff and the return line at, at our Kohl's is the same as the online pickup on so it took forever and I was exhausted standing there and there was no chairs because apparently you can't have chairs during COVID because <laughs> even Walmart took out their chairs and it's just like I am fat and pregnant I need to sit down <laughs> I was like this close sitting on the floor but then I might not have been able to get back up so who knows <laughs> anyways I am 17 weeks now 17 weeks in two days so I'm almost halfway there I'm excited about that but I'm still nervous about everything that happened last year so yeah, my next appointment for the baby is in two weeks. Two weeks from today. Yeah. And, yeah. I guess that's pretty much it. That's my end square and quick life update. <laughs> but it's like one something now. So I'm going to do this laundry and it'll be practically time to go get Jesse. And it's Friday and he's off for three days because of Labor Day. So that's nice that he's going to be home. I miss him so much when he's at school. I feel like we don't get to spend any time with him anymore. But... It's life. <laughs> he has to go to school. He has to learn. Anyways, I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video soon. And in my O video, I forgot what letter was next. Whenever I make it. <laughs> Bye, guys.